Hello, I'm Dr. Joe Iser, Chief Health Officer for the Southern Nevada Health District. Do you know what to do when someone is having a heat-related emergency? Each year, the Southern Nevada Health District receives reports of heat-related deaths. Last year, there were 123. July is consistently the deadliest month. Heat-related illnesses have different symptoms. Heat stroke occurs when the body's temperature rises rapidly. The person will have a high body temperature and hot, red, dry, or damp skin and a strong, fast pulse. Heat stroke is a medical emergency. If someone is having a heat stroke, call 911 immediately. Move him or her to a cooler place, lower the body temperature with cool towels, and do not give him or her anything to drink. Heat exhaustion happens as the result of the body overheating and can cause heavy sweating, faintness, nausea, headache, muscle cramps, a fast weak pulse, and cold, pale, or clammy skin. If someone is having heat exhaustion, move him or her to a cooler place, use wet cloths or towels to cool down. Heat cramps are the mildest of the three heat-related illnesses. They can progress to heat exhaustion if they are not treated. Heat cramps can cause heavy sweating during intense exercise or muscle pain or spasms. If someone has heat cramps, move him or her to a cooler place, use wet cloths or towels to cool him or her down, and loosen clothing. Learn more about how to recognize and treat heat-related illnesses to be safe this summer on our website's Recognizing and Treating Heat-Related Illnesses page.